Hello, welcome back to Blender Sushi Live Noting. In this episode, I want to share with you um, this uh, kind of like procedural railway that's kind of still work in progress, but it's it's nearly nearly work actually. Um, so I'm gonna try to explain how I created this. It's actually very similar to the procedural spiral stair that I made a couple of days ago. Um, so we only have a couple of parts so let's see we're gonna go backward so we have that that bits over there which is a uh, CEE and then we have just the rail I believe so the rail is okay there's of course the left one and the right one and yeah there's nothing much except that with the uh, something like the railway you want to kind of know where the track is going and it could also be like a roller coaster okay so we have uh, I have this frame info that goes into the seed so this one with this one I actually started with a circle and I have this noise displays and then the noise displays is being changed by the seed um, yeah, and then you can see it's kind of making this like a circular railway track. Um, the rest of them actually goes in and let's see. Okay, that's actually scaling it. So I have control over the rails itself. So how wide it should be. The one that's really doing the job is probably bevel a curve over here so this line generates um, kind of like the distance between two rails and then I've, I'm doing something here that's I've done earlier with the spiral stair please play polygon boom this first and last and UV connections those four actually together with the, another bevel curve is generating this so you might notice there's there might be like a slight weirdness over there so it's not perfect but I think it's getting there maybe it should be linear or oh, maybe not maybe I need to get rid of one of the last points the other one UV connections goes into there's even calculate normal or oh, this one actually I get rid of that one so don't worry about that UV connections the other one connects with a cylinder and duplicate objects along edge so this node is also super important in generating this so I believe I have control for the padding things like that mm. okay there's a, another multiplier for the rail cylinder so we can control the cylinder shapes um, okay that's the radius for the cylinder just very similar to the stairs but what's important here besides the circle beside the circle and the noise displays that I apply if I zero this out it's gonna be like circular right so instead of using circle we can also use something like sine oscillator so this one if I unplug this for now, if I just plug this into the bevel here, it's gonna change everything. So now you can see it's something that's more like a roller coaster, except that I might need to fix this. So instead of using householder, maybe it should be tracking, and tracking should be in the different axis 
okay the z-axis and turn off side click because it's not side click this is just like a roller coaster based on that that line over there sine oscillator so it can be a sine wave so I can control the amplitude period phase could be a square uh, you might notice there's some twists happening there the twist is actually interesting one because if I change this to linear so it works maybe it should be linear sine wave so triangle custom okay the custom for custom we probably need a wave and then we can try using vector noise based on line goes in here and this is like noise custom noise yeah it could be an in interesting roller coaster ride uh, it could be could also be like a, something like it's more like a 3d I believe If the line is not not a uh, basic like this but it's, it's a it's a good uh, setup I think good example and you can tweak this yourself until it works 100% even this is something that you can you can study further like maybe remix this value so you can mix sine and square and see how it works and suddenly you have a very interesting roller coaster ride oh that one's very dangerous but anyway yeah so I found this interesting and even though it's not 100% working yet but you get the, the basic idea and yeah try to make tweak yourself uh, remix this blend and see what you can come up with let me know and I'll see you next time thank you bye